Hello everybody, we're back on the Kirby Plush Network channel and we will be unboxing another plush as you can tell of course by the title and the thumbnail of the video we are unboxing Cook Kirby one of the ones I've been wanting for a while now as it is the old official one and it has gone a little rare but it's still basically around so I'm very, very glad that I scooped him up so let's just get to it I don't have scissors yet although I should have brought scissors so we'll have to do manpower here so opening the box right away you can see him here let me make sure that it's good so here he is wow so this guy is very very nice you can see his like very very new so you can see a little dust here that, that's okay you can knock that off so right off the bat you can see the nice good detail on him the nice beans and the feet that Sine is always known for the nice embroidering and eyes he is very very soft like like a velvety soft material i've never felt this on a kirby plush before wait thinking back i actually have felt this on a kirby plush before when i got the cutter kirby at best buy in 2017 so you can see the tag the tush tag here hell laboratory nintendo kirby made in china all that fine logo very very good so you can see the tag is on top of the head of course and you can see that they actually this is an old little buddy localization as it is their old logo of course so again made in china all the other details Cook Kirby small plush overall a very very nice one was not expecting him to be this soft very very great awesome awesome condition of course you can see the frying pan stuffed here a nice addition too as him holding it again the nice beans to make him stand of or sit down of course the nice chef hat the detail is also nice a little bit of a scratchy material there along with this so you can see his hanger tag and everything one last look over him, very very nice plush, probably one of my favorites, so if you notice my hands are kind of pink, I've been working on a few custom plushes, so it's also a very cool thing, very very soft again, so now let's get onto the comparisons with this guy. So we are back with Cook Kirby now, so let's move on to the comparisons, and starting off as I mentioned before with the same material feeling, is Cutter Kirby. So you notice that he's a little worn out because we've used him in a few of our videos, and we've had him since 2018, and we actually purchased him at Best Buy as well, and you can see that they have the nice same velvety soft material, which is also a very nice addition. You can see their eyes are pretty much the same, except that this one has a smile, this one has more of an open mouth, they still have like the same blush and everything, the same type of material which is also a very nice touch for one weird reason and yes this is official it does not have beans in the feet it just has some fluff and cardboard while this one does have beans in the feet so i've noticed some of the old sine kirby plushes don't have beans in the feet and some of them do and one thing to point out is that now this plush on ebay if you kept up with your instagram posts that this one is also being heavily bootlegged and using the exact same tag as this so one way to look out for it is to make sure that all of it's like the correct dating and stuff and of course the tush tag I, the bootleggers have been using a very short tush tag that is pink so if yours has that one it's probably bootleg but i'm pretty sure that was also used for the unlocalization correct me if i'm wrong down in the comments so again this one is be being heavily bootlegged but overall a very very nice plush again so one last comparison here same material and what's odd to point out is here is the 2011 cine kirby plush the original what's weird to point out is that this one's just like one shade it's very very soft while this one's more of like a velvety soft with a lot of texture you can see it like glowing it's very very nice very very good love that they've done that on the kirby copyability plushes well, this one's more of like a bland soft material so let us know in the comments which one you prefer so again pretty much same pattern except this one has like a little more of a closed mouth and this one's more up and of course a little bigger size of course because the old official or the old Sine one from 2009 2011 is also very big very tall again no beans in the feet just cardboard while some do have beans in the feet as i stated before so again a very very nice plush highly recommend if you can get your hands on it the bootleg is also pretty similar so this guy is going a little rare so if you do realize that so if you're very lucky we highly recommend you get this one but the bootleg one would also be a nice one as it's basically the same thing it looks very similar to this one and the bootleggers are getting very very good in higher quality in their plushes 
So either is basically fine, but it's always good to get the real stuff instead. So again, thank you guys so much for watching this review. Make sure to subscribe for more future content, of course, for the Kirby Plush series. More reviews and more unboxings in the future, along with some set overviews, hopefully, we can do in the future. So again, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Buh bye bye